Speaking of our Chief White House Correspondent John Carl, for more on this, and John, all through the weekend, uh, talk of negotiations between the U.S. and Mexico to keep those migrants in Mexico. Now the president out there tweeting this morning, he may permanently shut down the border, or at least try. Uh, he's certainly making that threat, George, but the administration is trying to work out a deal with the incoming president of Mexico. He takes office on Saturday, an agreement that would keep those migrants on the Mexico side of the border while they wait for those asylum claims. There have been conflicting reports about the progress of those negotiations. The Mexican or incoming Mexican interior minister uh, said that no deal has been reached yet. Meanwhile, the president is up this morning already tweeting about all this, saying that Mexico should send those migrants back to their home countries, saying do it by plane, do it by bus, do it any way you want, but they are not coming into the U.S. We will close the border permanently if need be. And John, meantime, on the Mueller investigation, the status report expect, expected on Paul Manafort. Of course, he's the president's former campaign chair and whether or not he's cooperating with Mueller today. As the White House appears to be bracing for a very tough report from Mueller, I was talking to Alan Dershowitz, who's been an ally of the president yesterday, said it could be devastating. Uh, absolutely, and it's a, it's a huge unknown here. The uh, White House, the president's legal team, they don't even know when this report is coming and what form it is coming, uh, but they are certainly bracing for bad news from Robert Mueller. Uh, the words from Alan Dershowitz, who has been a strong supporter of the president, were quite stark, uh, saying this will be devastating to the president. John Carl, thanks very much. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.